Chris Carlson here. Okay, I'm back. I'm so excited because we are moving right along through this Strong Start series on how to rock your direct sales business. So at this point, you should have a number of parties on your calendar. You should have those invites out. You should have been really talking about um, the best way to get the invite going for them. And now it's time to prep for your party. Now, a couple business things. You wanna make sure that you've got your catalogs ordered, you've got your, you know, all your business supplies ready to go. Every kit's a little bit different, but just a side note, make sure that you've kind of been walking through your back office and you've got what you need to be ready for your party. Because now, what we're gonna talk about is your initial party coming up, which probably is your launch party. Um, it may not, it, it isn't always. So whatever that first party is, I wanna talk to you a little bit about getting prepped for that. So the best ways to get comfortable for your first party, one is gonna be, I'd recommend that you're really working with your upline and you're gonna go shadow. So whoever sponsored you, I recommend that you go follow them at a party. Just join them, go crash their party and listen to what they do and take a notebook and sit back and just, tra that's training, you guys. That's getting you ready to feel comfortable doing it yourself. So I recommend one or two times where you go shadow your upline to see, you know, from a pro what they're doing. And then also like I have a YouTube video of my live party demo that I do for my product. There's so much out on YouTube right now. Go watch, if you can find a video of um, really doing a live party demo, I tell people just copy it until you get comfortable in your own skin. It's okay to do that. So I'm sure if you go with your company, you're gonna have some sort of a video to watch over and over again, just to really get comfortable comfortable with what you want to do. Now, I also recommend you make postcards and just as you're watching, jot down notes and make po postcards about what you want to say because trust me, it's easy to forget. You're nervous. It's your first few parties. The two big things with getting ready for your presentation are to think about um, what are you going to say because the key to your initial launch party is all about, and actually the key to all parties, but really in the beginning, it's learning the skill of getting bookings at your launch party, right? At my first launch party, I had a lot of people there, uh, maybe 11 or 12 people, and I got five bookings, you guys, that launched my business. Imagine what that would do for you. So I knew going in, that was the key. Not selling the product, it feels like it's gonna be all about selling the product, you guys, I get it, it's not. It's all about booking. So I recommend you put a little note somewhere in your presentation on the table that says booking talk. Because trust me, it's easy to forget. In the beginning, I remember being like, oh my goodness, I would go through a whole party and forget to talk about the booking benefits, which is the lifeline of our business. So don't forget about that. Make a little postcard, put it in the middle of your demo table. So when you're picking up the products, you see that card there that says, oh, booking. Oh, I almost forgot, there it is. So that's one little nugget for you, but really, you know, you just wanna be um, watching videos, shadowing your upline, getting comfortable, practice with your family, practice with your kids so that you feel really comfortable and just have fun. It's not about knowing everything, you guys. It's just not, it feels that way, I know in the beginning, but it's not about knowing everything. It's about having fun because that's contagious. My goodness, if you're having fun, you're gonna have people come up to you at your first launch party and say, you know what, how do I do this? You're having so much fun, I think I wanna sign up to do this. I had that happen at my first party. And I didn't know everything, but boy was I excited and passionate, tapping back to that why and that mindset that you have. If you're just excited and you don't feel like you have to know everything, that is contagious. So I'd recommend that you really focus on bookings, really focus on just having fun. And then as far as like be thinking about what, these are your family and friends, so do some fun giveaways. I recommend for the, for the party that you think of some fun little gift bags or a game about how to get bookings at your launch party. So it might be, you know what, the first five of you that book parties or the first three of you that book parties are gonna get this cute little gift bag that I put together just to say thank you for helping me get started and letting me practice. Um, now it doesn't have to be a ton of stuff, but it's fun to give some sort of a giveaway away, giveaway away for um, bookings and also just realize it doesn't have to be huge, but that it, it's gonna keep you remembering that that is the focus at your initial party is all about the bookings. So, um, so yeah, that's what I want you to do. Just be prepping, be getting excited, live and breathe your demo and don't be nervous, just have fun. And that will be contagious and it'll rub off to all of your people that are watching you at these first parties. So I will see you next time for our next video on how to rock your direct sales business in the beginning. See ya.